1986, Miranda Constantinidou founded her own fashion jewellery company. The idea was born of a naive dream. She wanted to make the world sparkle. Over the last 20 years, she has established an international brand and has set countless trends in fashion jewellery like nobody else. It's green, it's turquoise, they match. Then we add purple and bright yellow. It's not necessarily what you call a harmonious color scheme, but it's what absolutely gets my heart racing. Es ist trotzdem so, also dass dass ich absolutes Herz klopfen bekomme. Unconventional and free from the usual expectations and material limits, she has made her dreams reality. It's been a journey full of passion, but it's also meant plenty of obstacles. I don't think that any of us would have ever dared to take that step if we had known what we would have had to go through to get where we are now. A photo shoot in Berlin. The distal collection from Conplot is getting its turn in the limelight. For more than two decades, Miranda Constantinidou's creations have adorned the world of fashion magazines and the stars. But what makes this jewellery so special? Even the designer herself has to give the question some thought. An unwillingness to compromise on the details. And a lot of love. And I think I'm particularly good with colors. When it comes to jewelry and color, without being modest, that's where I'm absolutely the queen. Definitiv die Königin, glaube ich. Definitiv. Das kann ich ohne, ja, ohne Bescheidenheit sagen. Her designs are celebrated in some of the world's top cities, such as here in Beijing. And not just on the catwalks, her creations have been increasingly casting their spells from movie screens and on theatre stages. Rehearsals for Mozart's Magic Flute in the Berlin subway station under the Chancellery, Miranda Constantinidou designs the sensational costume for the Queen of the Night. The opera's epic staging attracted attention around the globe. In Vienna, she designed opulent jewellery for Helmut Baumann's production of Orpheus in the Underworld. This was a particular pleasure, but also a challenge. The Greek-born Miranda Constantinidou might have grown up in Germany, but she's passionately interested in Greek themes. Above all, she finds herself drawn to the characters in Greek myths, even if in this case they were transformed into sensuous caricatures. Here, she effectively mixed the Gothic with the glamorous. Hades and the dark forces of the underworld appeal to me. The kind of world evoked by claws and animal skulls. We dried several hen's feet and cast them. So this was once part of a real hen. In this way, the designer doesn't just easily bring up-to-date style and trends onto the stage. She also takes the great themes of drama into the world of fashion. Miranda says that her jewellery represents the constant friction between splendour and modesty, loud and quiet, courage and nostalgia. <laughs> When it comes to the design, I'm the boss. But everywhere else, I'm the one who gets bossed around. I can't go into my warehouse and touch anything. If I do, I hear, put that back, it's been ordered. But that's the way it should be. That's exactly how it should be. This is genau gut so. Conplot stands for exclusive designer jewellery, small, limited editions, but with a great diversity. In this way, more than a thousand designs, along with various colour combinations, are created every year. They include components such as beads or pieces of metal. These are often rare and irreplaceable, and they're brought together by Miranda Constantinidou from all over the world. Even today, she designs every piece of jewellery herself. Afterwards, each piece is handmade in her own workshop according to the strictest quality control standards. A few specially trained employees carry out the countless individual steps required in the innovative and traditional production methods.
A number of individual parts is really frightening. I'm really amazed at how many there are. A complex logistics program was developed. The challenge? Crafting an ever-changing collection of products with countless combinations of materials and production methods while also maintaining the highest standards of quality. The program also connects production and sales. In this way, new trends can be brought out very quickly. At the same time, Conplot, Miranda, Constantinidu stores are guaranteed to have the widest possible selection of products. This diversity is founded in a very special aspiration. Miranda wants to make jewellery for every woman, in every situation. The Maharani collection, too, has its own complicated history. It all started because I wanted to make something inspired by India. And then that simply took on a life of its own. Instead of ending up as something ethnic, it turned out very glamorous. And it fit in more and more with the fantasy that then emerged. Every collection has a particular woman at its focus, often historical figures, a friend, or a woman that the designer has only glimpsed or met fleetingly. She intensively imagines herself into the woman's personality. She tries to emphasize different moods and moments, and she often finds that her inspiration is liberated, resulting in a completely new creative dynamic. I had originally imagined a very different type of woman, more a diva, a bit distant, with a powerful charisma. And now I see that the jewelry fits with gracefulness and that it matches the person who wears it. Yes, and I like that a lot. A look back. Spring 2006, she was already the first non-French woman to receive the French Fashion Presses Award. Now, on the 20th anniversary of her brand, she again wins the eagerly sought-after award for the best complete collection. 20 years, always something different, always something surprising. And for the designer herself, even after all those years, it's still exciting. Now, for me, that's really another beautiful moment. When I saw that, I was really moved. That's wonderful. Miranda doesn't think about target markets, she thinks about moments. Every woman should be able to find a favorite piece of jewelry for every single situation and for every occasion. She wants to bring out each woman's many facets and advocates a deep self-confidence that goes beyond the typical roles and cliches. This is also true for her employees. As she puts it, we're a woman's company. I don't have anything against men, but I just think that men should work with men and women with women. We speak different languages, see the world differently. A table of men and a table of women will have different conversations, and it's the same at work. Women look at a job they have to do as if it were their baby. Cebu, the second largest city in the Philippines and the island nation's economic center. Here is where Conplot jewelry is made. From the lobby to the conference table, the women wield the power. Having jobs with Conplot means that the Filipino women are also the ones who are in charge at home. They're the ones who bring in the main income for the family. They're the ones who take care of their parents. They're the ones who take out insurance for their parents and their children. They're independent. They don't have to marry. Miranda Constantinidou can be summarized in one word, freedom. A word that has accompanied and shaped her entire life. An attitude towards life that she has passed on to the women who work for her. Despite all the resistance she's faced, giving up was never an option. Her dream of giving women the power in her own company at least has been fulfilled. Whether in manufacture or administration, every employee has the job that she can do best. I find it quite emancipated in a Catholic country. I was sometimes afraid that I'd be found dead somewhere because some guy killed me on the side. <laughs> But I thought, oh well. <laughs>
The idea of a woman's company was successful. Today, Conplot sells its jewellery in more than 800 shops, among them 40 of its own stores, in world-class cities such as Madrid, Berlin, Shanghai, and, of course, Paris. Here, in the Rue Pierre Charon, one of the most exclusive shopping streets in the world. It's just before closing. Miranda manages to drop by just in time. She meets the people who embody her philosophy, a very special moment. Hello! Hello! <laughs> Things have come full circle again. Once more, new collections are ready to be discovered. The store is so beautiful, and finally I get to see my creations brought together, beautifully arranged by color and with the right lighting. That's so different than when I'm designing them. She is one step closer to her dream, to make the world sparkle. That's what Conplot, Miranda Constantinidou, stands for.